I've got something else in Blender that I could show you that I'll show you this in a new scene actually and that is something called I'll just uh, just a little heads up this is something that I procured through the vendor the other day it is something called the car transporter I'll go and I'll just leave everything else in here that's actually a plugin car transporter car, car sorry car teleporter that's the one it's a plugin that is about two gigabytes in size and it gives you access to any of these manufacturers cars so you could go and click mercedes it has a little asset browser and you just click on this and there you have all types of you know g wagons and all kinds of mercedes here but it's not just mercedes it's also audis so click on it pick an audi uh, maybe the RS7 C8 <laughs> or something else, maybe like a Dodge or a Ferrari. There we go, three Dodges. Or maybe, how about a Rolls Royce? Yes, my roller. Or even uh, there's Land Rover, McLaren, Tesla. How about, how about Tesla? Tesla's good. Uh, pick maybe the blue one. Perhaps the blue one goes faster than the red one. I don't know. And then you click it and you say add car. And it sounds insane, but that now adds a fully detailed, fully rigged car to your scene. And when I say fully rigged, it's rigged with some magic called rig a car. If you, I don't know if you've heard of it, but if you have, then you'll recognize these things here, back and forth and, and all that. So rig a car is a thing that lets you, much like in the village generator, define a path and a surface onto which the car can then drive. I'll just let Blender calculate this here a little bit. There we go. So we do have we do have some some materials on this, which can also be changed. So it's it's kind of cool. You have a highly detailed car that can just be brought in. And not only that, it is rigged with suspension. So if you go and use rig a car to define a path and a road, and you can literally make this thing drive. So the wheels or four wheels rotate. And if there's bumps in the surface, the wheels will go up and down. So it's very, very cool. You can click make editable. And then after a second or so, there we go. The car is now fully riggable. So, well, not riggable, but, but you can open this up. I think this is RZ and you can go and open the doors. So it does come with interiors as well, which is insane, I have to say. And I think you can open the hood as well. So that is RX, I think, there we go. So it is all fully rigged. The wheels will turn, but it takes a little bit of time to set this up. So I'll go and make another video about how to do this in detail, maybe even make a stream. But just to show you what is possible here, I have a little thing that I've pre-rendered and that is, that's very neat, isn't it, Rod? And I think the whole package costs you 120 bucks, but that comes with like over 90 cars, which is insane stuff. But you can also, um, let's see if I can find it here. Rig a car Bugatti Vision, that's the one. Okay, cool. I think we can do this. There we go. This is this is something that is essentially in in this rigged version. So the, the wheels rotate and the uh, the the path here is literally just made out of plane. So it looks it looks a bit trashy the road, but I'll need to practice on this a little bit more. But yeah, this is how it works essentially. You can see the wheels moving there, you can see that they're rotating, and yeah, this is all done with a few clicks in Blender, and this is just super, super awesome. Very exciting stuff. I'm, I was really, really excited to, uh, to, to get a hold of that and, and play with it. So I'll never have to buy cars ever again. And I was thinking this would be a great project to combine this with the village generator and then literally have the car just go drive through the village, especially if the village had other assets. So yeah, there we go. I'll go and make this public on my other YouTube channel, on the 3D Shenanigans channel. So much fun you can have with 3D. It's crazy stuff. And this is not down to geometry nodes. This is down to a wonderful man from France whose name I've sadly forgotten. And he has, uh, yeah, let me just have a look at a few other cars here. And he has, oops, he has made this plugin called Rigicar. And that is good for all kinds of four wheeled vehicles that he said were a little bit difficult to rig. So he's made some magic that makes it possible. And this plugin here, this is by Elmas. This is the car transporter that uses that plugin to utilize its funky cool concepts also great great example of what can happen when when things are open source and you can just go and say hey do you know what i've worked something out here it is community make with it what you will yeah highly highly detailed so that's the only thing that you have to remember if you wanted to open the doors or anything you just have to go and make the car editable and then it just takes a second and then the instance is being turned into full geometry and then you can go and rig it and then you can go and open the doors and it's easy to change the color as well but i'll, I'll go cover that in another video very neat huh even car suspension absolutely it's so cool